Jewish communities across the Bay State are remembering the lives lost during Saturday's deadly shooting in Pittsburgh. 22 News reporter Jennifer Zarate tells us why the city of Springfield felt it was important to come together to mourn the victims of yesterday's tragedy. Hundreds of people of all faiths gathered at Temple Bethel in Springfield Sunday afternoon to pay their respects to the 11 victims killed in the Pittsburgh synagogue shooting Saturday morning. To the individuals and families that were affected by the uh, uh, Tree of Life synagogue massacre, my thoughts and prayers and, and sympathy and encouragement go out to all of them and also to the first responders, the brave men and women in blue. Robert Bowers is the man accused of gunning down the 11 people and Mayor Sarno said people like Bowers want others to live life in fear and lose their sense of community. As you can see today, we will not lose that. If anything, it strengthens our resolve. Which is why he and Springfield Police Commissioner John Barbieri ordered increased safety measures for all of the city synagogues and Jewish Community Center. Rabbi Amy Wall Katz of Temple Bethel told 22 News the synagogue shooting sent a message that anybody who believes in God was assaulted. And for that reason, she said it was important to come together because what happened in Pittsburgh could have happened in any synagogue in the U.S. We are going to continue to dream and hope for a better world, and we're just not going to sit around and wait for it. We're going to have to act to make it happen. As for what comes next, Rabbi Katz said they will continue to fight the hatred and protect themselves as best they can. Reporting in Springfield, Jennifer Zarate, 22 News.